Turkey is a traditional Thanksgiving meat or meal, and this year uh, we decided we were gonna do elk roast. We have guests coming over, family coming over, and so I have elk roast here from an elk that I harvested last month. Giving elk roast. And so uh, several pounds of elk roast here. We're using a crock pot today, and you could probably do this in a roaster in your oven, uh, or in a Dutch oven, or a number of ways. But crock pot is just the way that uh, we've been using the last several times that we cook elk, uh, pronghorn, mule deer roast. You could do this with uh, moose. You could do it with uh, uh, with caribou, white-tailed deer, just about any large game animal. Go ahead and sear it here in the pan. Just give it a little black and uh, on each edge. I have a cast iron skillet that's been heated up here. All right, so I put it in the crock pot here. I have the crock pot on low for now. Uh, again, we have several hours before anybody's going to be here. It's actually, in the wee hours of the, of the night here. So I'm going to go ahead and just dump some water in there. Um, I don't really use a lot of precise measurements. So we got a couple of cups of uh, warm water in there. Create a base for the gravy, if you will. We have Worcestershire sauce, if that's how you pronounce it. And uh, again, not a lot of measuring going on here, but. I'm going to put a couple tablespoons of Worcestershire in there to begin with. And what's going to happen is as the elk starts to cook, it's going to create a lot of its own uh, gravy. Uh, have black pepper. Some garlic powder. We'll be using a lot of garlic here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put some fresh garlic in here. I have a couple cloves of fresh garlic. Some onions. Lots of this stuff will cook out and it'll create good flavor. We have potatoes, carrots, a little more Worcestershire on the top, a good measure, and some water, and a little bit of salt, and just put the lid on. Uh, guests won't be getting over here for another seven hours or so. We have plenty of time. My roast actually isn't even 100% thawed yet, so I'm going to start this on low. If you were in a hurry and your roast was completely thawed, you could start this on high. Uh, they cook very quickly. And what are we going to have for Thanksgiving? Our roast! For turkey. Instead of turkey? For turkey Do you like elk? Yeah, I love elk summer sausage. We made it eight days ago. Okay, our guests are going to be here in about 45 minutes. Um, we started this thing at about 3 a.m. We got up at 3 a.m. Actually, I was still up at 3 a.m. cleaning the house. I apologize if you hear a baby crying in the background. Our 10-month-old uh, Natalie uh, doesn't want to take her nap. Now I've really had to do very little to the uh, elk over the last couple hours. Um, you know, we put it in there at three o'clock. I woke up around 7.30. Um, I basically stirred the pot. Um, at that time, you know, the elk was getting somewhat tender. So I went ahead and just cut it up in the pot. As the vegetables start to cook down, I take extra carrots, potatoes, and onions, put them in the microwave for several minutes to steam them, and then put them in there as well to keep adding more vegetables to the base. So let's take a look. A lot of good flavor in there. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the meat here. Just gonna grab a piece at random here. Mmm, very delicious. I'm gonna roast this in the crock pot. It's over the course of uh, 
you know, six hours, eight hours. Um, what I like to do is season the roast as we go, just to add some more flavors as things cook and move around. Put some more black pepper in there. And even a little bit of Jane's crazy mixed up salt. I also like to add a little butter as we get towards the end. I find it just helps out with the overall flavor, um, the creamy texture of the gravy. I don't use a lot of salt in my cooking, but I just find for some reason when I'm making elk roast that salt just really seems to bring out the flavor of the meat. So I do put a little bit of salt once in a while on there. All right, guests are arriving. There's Grandma and Grandpa are here. Hannah singing Our God Saves. Hi! Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving! Oh, yummy! Happy Thanksgiving!